Oh, what's up, beautiful people? This is Mike from My Guess Well, and I hope you are having an amazing day. And yes, today is the exciting day because we have the Forza Horizon 5 out on the Game Pass and also out if you want to buy if you don't have the Game Pass membership. For all those Game Pass members, it is free to play on PC and on Xbox Series X. So I'm going to be testing it on both because I have the Xbox Series X and also the PC with the RTX 3080 graphic card. So make sure to watch this video and also subscribe to the channel for more videos and give it a thumbs up if you really like the content. All right, so today's video I'm recording from my camera. It is not the game capture through the capture card because that's not gonna show you or even reflect what I'm seeing from my eyes. So I'm directly recording from my seat and that you can see in front of it, it's totally dark room and I have my camera set up and you can see that the Xbox has started. I'm going to show you guys the settings, which I thanked LG for coming up with the Dolby Vision update for the Xbox Series X. And now it's the LG OLED C10 can do everything that your LG OLED C1 can do minus the game bar because we do not have the game bar and the web OS, the new one. And especially I'm not really a big fan of the new web OS. I really like this fast and fluid but you got to make sure that you have 4k tv detail settings all check marks showing and if not then you might want to go and enable the dolby vision to get the advantage of the dolby vision gaming because this game forza horizon 5 natively supports the dolby vision you must have realized by now that if you play the forza horizon 4 it just pushes to the hdr signal so now it is using that metadata and shows you which game is actually in the Dolby Vision. And you're gonna see that on the right top pop-up, it will say Dolby Vision. So that's the instant game mode and we have the Dolby Vision. And the best thing right now is that we have the Dolby Vision gaming mode on the LG OLED C10, which supports up to 120 Hertz. And also it is already tweaked, so you don't have to do a lot of settings or anything because it is already on the warm to on the industry standard setting. So you don't, have to go and change it from cool to medium or tone it down all the way down to the warm to. So it's already on that where it has to be. So I'm gonna show you in my settings, but first of all, look at this opening scene of the Forza Horizon 5. It just looks a masterpiece, incredible looking game. And yes, it is a level up from the Forza Horizon 4 for sure, because you can see a lot more details now in your surroundings. And I'm going to be running this in the 30 FPS because I'm really concerned about the fidelity. And I've been playing this game and I really don't see any issues with the 30 FPS. So right now I'm in the game mode. Only thing that I have turned low or zero is the sharpness because I don't want that edit sharpness by the TV. It's already sharp enough 4K content. And if I go to advanced settings, make sure that everything is disabled. It's already disabled by default, but if you go to the color temperature, it's already warm too. So this is a good thing that LG has done with this update for the Dolby Vision Gaming that is already at warm to where it should be. All right, and then we're gonna go one more thing down, picture setting, make sure that all of these things are off. They're off by default, but some people like to turn on the true motion. I actually leave everything off because it eliminates all of that input lag. But if you really wanna play with some settings, you can. There's smooth gradation that you can use, but I don't see any bending happening in these guys. So I think Dolby Vision Gaming Mode has perfected the gaming, especially for this one, because it's developed for the Dolby Vision. Whenever you play, it shows you the Dolby Vision pop-up. And I can go to the HDMI and you can see that I'm running Dolby Vision and Dolby Atmos and BT2020 color, which is the 10-bit HDR and Dolby Vision layer on top of it. So we have everything working the way it should be. And you can see this beautiful game. This is right now exactly captured from my camera and you can see this beautiful game right here and the reflections, uh, the ray tracing, everything just works amazing. All right, and you can see also the information for the free sync that we have everything enabled and we're still getting the Dolby Vision. All right, so now I'm gonna show you the gameplay. I did a race that I won. It was my first attempt to it. So just enjoy that and make sure don't forget to hit the like on this video and also consider subscribing to the channel and I'm back with more content and I'll see you guys in another one. Until then, peace out and enjoy this beautiful game.
your destination. Final straight and this kid is not stopping! 